That is so much fun. Hello guys, Big Daddy Hoffman 1911 coming to you today. And we've got some nice rifles on the table. Look at that, would you? Yeah. All right, buddy, tell me something about these. All right, we got the uh, Mini 14s out on the table. Uh, like this one's, this is the one we kind of really wanted to shoot today. It's the folding stock on it. This is this reminds me of my childhood. This is the version that uh, uh, Hannibal, the leader of the A team, would carry around um, back in that '80s television show. If you've never watched the A team, guys, you need to do that. That's like a, a prerequisite, right? Yeah, this one's pretty cool. I found this at a gun show probably three and a half years ago. And never pulled the trigger on it. They're not making this version anymore. Takes the same same round, two two three, or five five six. It's marked for two two three, but you can shoot five five six through them. Mm -hmm. This is like the little ranch rifle. So it's a civilian version of the M14, which was the which was the military rifle of the time. So this is a M1A, which is a civilian version of the M14. It takes a three oh eight. I love this rifle. Yeah, the M14 was a select fire rifle used by the U.S. military. Mm -hmm. And then, then we have the grandpa here, the <laughs> the M1 Garand. It's going to take the 30 out six round. Yep. Beautiful so, rifle. So there's your lineage, right? So, All right. And they came with five round magazines, right? And then, shortly after Bill Ruger's death. You wind up seeing um, Ruger producing 30-round magazines yep. for the uh, the Mini 14, which really makes it a modern sure. know, weapon. So sure, I just like the look of this one. Yeah, this is how it works. <clears throat> Has the same uh, similar uh, similar operating, just smaller uh, of the Garand and the uh, the M1A. So what's cool about this stock here? There you go. There you go. You got this little cap right there. There's a button. This is really sturdy. You push the button down and then fold this. And it doesn't latch in there. What you have to do is push this little button down and this folds the, the butt plate back or butt stock there. And, locks and that locks it in place right there. See that? Yep. Yeah, you don't have to fight that one either. That's what I like that. Sweet. Sweet rifle right there. Okay guys, there she is. All right, we're gonna shoot it folded first. All right, let's make it happen. That is so nice. Okay, you ready? Well, I got a couple good shots there, didn't I? Sweet. Guys, here's your safety on this bad boy. All right, so we just flip it up. Yeah, we'll be ready to rock and roll. Here we go. <laughs> That's a sweet shooter, isn't it? You gotta shoot this one, Greg. Oh yeah. Let's go load it up. That's fun to shoot. That's pretty fun. All right. All right, buddy. So here's a different variation. A little ranch rifle. Nice wooden stock. Right, let's see what you can do with that. All right, I got to zoom in on those headshots there. Pretty nice there, buddy. Yeah, you got to practice for the zombies. Yeah. It's a very accurate rifle. Yep.
kind of very accurate. Kind of mixes the best of both worlds, I think, of the uh, old and new school. You know, you oh yeah, choose that real inexpensive two two three round. Yep. You know, the only thing I don't like about it is uh, it's a small sight picture you get here. I, I think they make a couple different versions with different uh, sights on it, like a GI sight or something like that. Uh -huh. I don't know. Maybe the guys know something. Yeah. Maybe, maybe they know something about it. Yeah, guys, if you know anything about it, post it in the comments in the video here. But I just, I have a little bit of trouble seeing through that, you know? It's such a simple, robust system, you know? With the AR-15, it's so cool, but there's like 15 million springs in it, you know, and mm -hmm. uh, it's it's polymer and it's cool, but this is just, you know, all metal and wood. You gotta love that. All right, this time we got the 30 round magazine, guys. Here we go. All right. Let's let them rip. That's what I'm talking about right there. I'll tell you what, it does shoot well, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh man, I'll tell you one thing. I love it when a plan comes together. <laughs> Isn't that what that guy said? Yes, it is. <laughs> All right. All right, guys. If you have uh, any information or like to share your experiences with these, because uh, I don't know a whole lot about them, uh, please, again, post it in the comments below. And uh, I really enjoyed this. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you guys enjoyed shooting it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's about time after three and a half years, right? Yeah. <laughs> you saved three and a half years, right? Yeah. Well, I mean, it's a great gun show. Fine. You know, and it's something about these type rifles, you know, the wood and the metal, like Jason was saying. So, all right, guys, keep up the fight against gun control. And as always, remember, Big Daddy loves you. Hoorah. Take care. I'm going to right for the temple. There you go. <laughs> that's pretty good. <laughs> now, <laughs> that's a zombie shot right there. Yeah. Yeah. That is grand. That is grand. Yeah. Sweet.